You know, this isn't really just a celebration uh, of Joe's birthday. I managed to get this far, and yes, yeah, sort of is, but really I'm just one kind of who rounds up everybody. I'm kind of the ringleader, you know, and say, let's have a big party. We can use my 60th birthday as a big excuse. We'll all get together and play some music, because guess what? We're all still here. Yeah. Well, well put. Yeah. It's also Jeff Carver's celebration here. He's the guy doing the sound, and but nobody knows who he is. He's an attorney. He's taking the Fifth Amendment. He's sneaking around. You never look. He, he probably looks like a terrorist carrying along a, like a Molotov cocktail. Yeah, yeah. he's kind of hard guy to hide, you know. He's he's his birthday's the day before mine, so I don't know if that makes him any older than me or not. He's trying hard to catch up. We're having a race. We're all winning. And hey Joe, you know what you call a pretty girl on a guitarist's arm? A tattoo. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, uh, speaking of Joe and all the people he assembles, it reminds me that we can't do this by ourselves. We need help. Great. All you guys. We need help. And we're glad you're here. Without audiences, we would just be playing with ourselves. Which ain't bad, but... <laughs> I use my guitar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're gonna do a song called Help Me. It goes like this. One, two, one, two, three. Somebody dancing up there. Jeff? There's sawdust right here. There we go, Jeff. Go, man, go. go. All right. Woo. You gotta help me. I can't do it by myself. You gotta help me, little darling. Can't do it by myself. If you don't help me, darling, you know I'm gonna have to find somebody else. I might have to cook, I might have to sew, I don't know, I might even mop the floor. You gotta help me. I can't do it by myself. If you don't help me, darling. I'm gonna have to find somebody else. Get it, Terry. Feel like sleeping, but I feel like laying down. Hit it, 
Joe. Recently, I'm sure you can relate, mostly the guys anyway, maybe the girls, came home really late. How late was it? Well, when I came out in the morning, three of the tires were on the front lawn, one of them was in the driveway. Yeah, that late. And I just wanted to get a little help from my sweet little loving thing, you know. She was in there sleeping. I knew she was sleeping before I even got in the house because I could see the curtains going back and forth with the snoring. And I snuck in there real quiet. I was trying to be quiet, but actually, it wasn't quite that quiet. I was making some weird noises. I think Terry was with me. <laughs> and quiet. Snug in there. Rubbed the hair off her face a little bit. I said, darling, you gotta help me. She opened one eye, looked up at me, and she said, are you nuts? Well, that's the end of my story. And the moral is, I guess I'm gonna have to do it by myself. There's nothing left to do. Here we go.